All right, y'all, so I'm about to get ready to go inside. I am scared. I am shaking in my freaking pants, but I'm about to go in here, see my people, and yeah, let's go. So you see it? You see it? <laughs> If you are new here, oh, I am Amy Lee, and if you are no, new, don't do that, don't do it, don't do it. Bye. Hey, y'all, so we before we hop right in, I would like to say thanks to BetterHelp for sponsoring today's video. Let's touch base on mental health. I get asked a lot about how I'm feeling and doing mentally on a daily basis. Usually my response is always, I'm doing good, but sometimes I do have my days where I struggle. A lot has happened to me over the past year that many of you may know about when it comes to both of my parents being deceased and other drastic changes in my life. I feel like I've been very open about my well-being to a certain and level but sometimes I do think about seeking a little help when it comes to my mental health. In today's society majority of us struggle when it comes to our mental health and we don't like to seek help because we think we can handle it all on our own. What we don't realize is that we are carrying a lot of weight that we eventually become overwhelming. We need to begin releasing some of that weight which is why I believe therapy would be a great start. So let me introduce you to BetterHelp. BetterHelp connects you with licensed therapists who are trained to listen and give you helpful, unbiased advice that will help you unravel what you may be going through. To access BetterHelp, you will go to their website by using my link and answer a few questions. That way, BetterHelp will match you with a professional who has years of experience helping people with struggles. One thing I like is that you can attend your meetings by phone or computer by doing a call, video chats, or messaging. Basically, whatever you are comfortable with from the comfort of your home. Let BetterHelp connect you to a therapist who can support you. If you are interested, head to betterhelp.com slash miniweek to get started. As you guys already know, all details will be listed down in my description box below. And with that being said, let's go ahead and get back into today's video. Hello my Wheaties and welcome back to another video. If you are new here, I am Mini Wheat and if you are a returning subscriber, you already know the vibes. Hey everyone, I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. It's 9.41 in the morning. Early. Well, it's not early no more. It's not early no more. I've been up since 7 o'clock this morning. Get myself together because I have a cram day ahead of me, okay? If y'all don't know, this is the beginning of my freaking birthday prep vlog and we starting off here at the freaking wax place <laughs> your girl have to get her stuff waxed you know get my underarms waxed stuff like that i'm just here for that starting off this vlog of course i'm not going to take y'all in the inside because you know i can't be recording no stuff like that but this is the beginning of the freaking birthday vlog y'all and i have a lot to freaking do like i have a cramped day ahead of me like i hope it doesn't be as cramped as i'm thinking it's going to be but if it is hey we're just going to get through it i look a hot piss i look crazy okay but it's okay because i'm not gonna be looking crazy later i have a hair appointment to go to today i have to do my nails i have to pick up my clothes from the alteration spot i'm excited for that to see how my outfit is gonna look i actually took her another outfit but i didn't record that the second outfit that i was talking to y'all about i end up taking it to her she says she's gonna have it done today so i got that coming up i gotta pick that up today around four o'clock my hair appointment is around one o'clock and then i need to also swing by the mall if i can by any chance Fingers crossed that I'm going to be able to go by the mall because I really, 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 really need to go by the mall, y'all. I need to find like a gold purse, a gold pouch purse. Not really no gold heels because I feel like I got gold heels already, but I definitely need a purse because I don't want to wear my coach pillow tabby. I feel like I wear that bag with everything. So fingers crossed I'll be able to find that. And what else I need out the mall? Oh, girl. That was a lot of beeping. What else I was about to say? She, dang, that, that, that took my mind elsewhere. Um... I don't know, that took my mind elsewhere. Now I don't know what I what what else I was talking about. I don't know. I don't even know. That just blew my mind. But I will talk to you guys once I get done, once I finish up at the wax place, and then we're gonna get into all our activities and festivities and ripping and running and stuff like that once I get out of this appointment. So I'll talk to you guys later. Hey y'all, so quick update. I know it's a little bit dark right now, but I am at my hairstylist place and I'm about to get my hair done finally. Now y'all, let me let me give y'all a whole little rundown real quick. I left my wax appointment, ran some errands, came back home, looked at my 
lace and I think I stained my lace. I'm hoping and praying that it still gives what it needs to give because oh my gosh, that was a really good lace. And dyeing that hair jet black, I should have did like multiple coats of got to be spray on the lace, bro. I did not do that. So it stained a little bit. I know for a fact it stained a little bit, but I hope that she able to <sighs> I just can't believe I was so stupid to do that, but I hope it's able to still like give on my head or whatever. I brought some extra wigs too, just in case she be like, nah, this ain't gonna work. But I'm hoping it's gonna work because I didn't spend my hard earned money on some dye. And I also took my precious time dying the wig, even though the mistake was on me. But oh my gosh, I just want a freaking jet black hair, hair install today. Like I just want jet black. Like I just got to have that, a jet black install. I'm doing me a middle part with curtain bangs and I hope it really turned out right because I've never had like curtain bangs before with a middle part. I've never had curtain bangs ever, a curtain bang ever, but I hope it turned out right. But I gotta go inside because it's 1257 and my appointment at one. So let me go ahead and get in here. <laughs> <laughs> just hair stuff now. Exactly. Yeah. But the YouTube, like, uh. <laughs> oh my gosh. I said I was going to record your, um, your Insta. I'm like, forget it. Oh my gosh, man. I'm going to do the next one, though. Okay. Y'all see. Of she didn't come with your makeup done, though. Y'all see my hair? See, I, I didn't do right. <laughs> I was supposed to come with my makeup on, y'all. I didn't come with my makeup, but y'all see my hair. It looks so good. Too good. Now you can really say I ain't cheat on you, for real. Exactly. Because <laughs> I only got my hair done here one time. You was definitely waiting on me. <laughs> All right, y'all, your girl, hold on. Your girl, Mini Wee, is out and the hair is late. I look real good, y'all. If y'all hear a little noise, that's my car real quick. I don't know why my car would be doing that. But I am about to head to the freaking alteration spot because I need to pick up my clothes. I need to pick up my clothes ASAP. I really love my hair, y'all. Like, I look so freaking good. Like, I look like a whole freaking baddie out here. I look so freaking good. So good. Y'all can't tell me nothing. Y'all can't tell me I don't look good. Sequoia 8. I missed her. I missed her. I missed her. I missed her, y'all. Because I'm telling y'all, she be eating on my hair. Like, what? Is this 23-year-old E? What? <laughs> It is the next freaking day, y'all, and we are at freaking Marshall's, as y'all can see. I am at side, outside of Marshall's because I'm about to go inside because I need to find my godson something to wear to my party. Now, I told everybody they need to wear brown, and that's going to be the theme. Brown, brown, brown. I need everybody to wear brown. Now, this was supposed... Let me backtrack. Now, this vlog right here was supposed to be a maintenance vlog, but it's not a maintenance vlog. It's just going to be the full weekend. My party, me getting ready, like, it's going to be everything because I don't know what was going on with me yesterday before I got down here I just couldn't get no footage like I, I feel like I was ripping and ripping and ripping and ripping and ripping and running and ripping and running and ripping and ripping and ripping and running I could not get myself together or pull myself together to grab my camera and get footage my nails not even done neither are my toes and I need to go get those things done at least today or by tomorrow morning like seriously I'm about to walk inside of here see what they got see what they working with because my god baby definitely needs something that's on theme i love talking about him y'all y'all saya got to the point now where he called me mimi all the time y'all he be like mimi 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 he he know i'm his mimi like he called me mimi so i like oh, it just be warming my little heart but enough of that let me let me go and get this out of here because it's about to start raining and i'm trying to beat the rain yeah i'm hoping while i'm in here they have some really good stuff well not really good stuff but you know something for him that i need i also need to check and see do they have a gold clutch because i need a gold clutch for tomorrow because i don't have no gold bag Ooh, this is actually cute. I like this bag. 
I might be getting this. It was a fail, y'all. I did not find my godson anything, but I did find me a purse. Oh, my hair blowing everywhere. Hold on. Hold on. Yeah, okay, I had to get back. I had to get back with the get back. Marshalls was a complete fail. I did not find my godson anything, but I did end up spending $74 on myself buying, just, just buying stuff. So I found the viral Duke Van Cleef bracelet, y'all. Okay, first I bought this bag. I bought this cute little bag because I feel like it will go really, really well with my outfit tomorrow. Then I bought this cute Van Cleef bracelet, y'all. They had two of them in there. I was going to buy it, both of them, but it's a Van Cleef dupe, the Rachel Zoe bracelet. It was so freaking cute y'all see that really really cute y'all it's so cute y'all can see it better now yeah so i bought this one because i rarely see these inside of the store and like what i saw this in marshall and i was like okay let me grab okay you know wear that one until i get the real okay <laughs> and then i also bought me some earrings which the other earring is in here but i tried on the earring in the store and i ended up not putting the back back on it and putting it back in the box so i did some earrings this all for tomorrow but i need to go find another store to figure out what my godson is going to wear i'm about to try h&m because i know h&m going to have something i know she didn't go have some, so I'm just go ahead and go in there. It's the next day again, <laughs> and we're back again inside of the car, y'all. Today is actually the day of my party, which is the crazy and funniest thing. I don't know. I think we left off yesterday where I was at freaking Marshalls and I did not find my godson anything to wear, but I ended up going to H and M and I found pants in there. Then I had to go to another store. I didn't vlog. I'm sorry about that, y'all. It's just I don't know. It's just a lot been going on here. When I tell y'all yesterday, it started pouring down bad like it was raining real, real bad y'all was still and, out and and she went complaining about how bad it was raining we had to load and unload your stuff in the rain well i'm sorry i ain't tell y'all to do that but yeah girl many we had to do some hair yeah you did uh i was ripping and running all day trying to get my stuff together is the still rain. ain't got your nails done still ain't uh, I'm doing my nails today, okay. but I, we definitely got to go and get my toes done. So right now we are currently outside of Target because I need to get some freaking Mighty Patches. Let me see that. Because these pimples, if I let my Mighty Patch sit on for like six hours, Ooh, can I get some uh, I'm going to let it do that. But it's just the thing about this, y'all. My only thing is that when I use pimple patches, y'all, it leaves a dark mark on my face. And I do not want a dark mark on my face. So I kind of want to leave a pimple like where they at and just put like little beauty molds right there. But at the same time, I'm like, Ugh, um. it's my part. Yeah. I need them to blemish away. So I need to wear them for at least six hours before I actually start getting ready. It's like nah nine nine what was that <laughs> nine it's, it's like 9 30 right now and i want to start getting ready at least by like one o'clock like i want to get yeah, a shower it's, it's like, nine, like that. Okay. so yeah i need to get it together and Both get to yeah. moving get some motion going on right and right after this we're going to get my toes done because i need my toes done because i'm wearing heels so are you ready zariah are you ready run? yes i'm ready to go okay, on you ready all right y'all let's go we can do this target run who put these pants right here <laughs> with me. We marked off the first thing, which was some that freaking was makeup. Oh, Mighty Patch is right here. Y'all, so I've been hearing about this refinery. Um, right. Refinery. What is it called? Refinery, refinery, refinery. Refinery? Refinery. Is, is um, it perfume? Yeah, perfume. Okay. Mm -hmm. yeah, this is the one that I want. Wrap it it's up. only one lip. It's only one lip. But I heard it smells really good, so I want to spray it. Check it out. It don't stink, but like. It ain't. It's not my cup of tea. It's not. Ooh, this the new Rouge. I don't know. I don't really. I don't, I don't really care for that. <clears throat> we only been in the store for five minutes. That's the new Rouge flavor. I meant scent. <laughs> I'm sorry. I don't really care for flavor. that. Yeah. <laughs> Let me try this one. The musk. They think he the baddest. They call it eat a musk. Come on, I'm trying to go to Skeechy. It smelled good, but it smelled like something else too. Come on, I got this one. That would be this one. Fourteen ninety nine. I ain't even got two dollars. My bad. Ooh, the pistachio, please smell what's the, good. What's the pistachio? Is that it one smell one? good. The blue one, the, not that blue. It's the teal. Yeah. I don't think it, it don't look. That like one smell good. They ain't got that one. What that mean? We don't need to get it. Okay. Yeah. Let's go see how that's much a, those pimple patches was. That's so sorry. Cause she wants some star face. You shy? <laughs> I made it here to the nail shop, y'all, and I'm about to go ahead and get my toes done for today because they need to be done real bad. I'm going to just get some regular white toes, right? What should I do? No, just regular white because they look, bro, they look good. 
Do you see that? You can't even see. You got glasses. <laughs> no, but I can see from this. It's not far far. Yo, I'm be helping Elto get ready and I'm be partying. I'm gonna eat some of that good food. I'm excited to see what y'all did. You can't tell me. Oh, I'm, I'm not. I'm ready to see what y'all did. It was my idea to let it be a surprise. Cause you know it was me and DJ idea because the more and all and mama was like I can't I can't wait for Elta to come over here and see I said uh uh let it be a surprise I said she that's why I was like we need to drop all y'all for Elta cooking and not let Elta come over here and get it get her because it would be better for it to be a surprise. What if I hate it? Hmm? What if I hate it? You not gonna hate it. <laughs> and then it's like who did I show? I showed it to Kanye right? Kanye was like is she bougie? I was like no. <laughs> My cousin. No, my oh, yo, yeah, my day one, and she was like, uh, is, she is she bougie? And I was like, no, not at all. We go see. You gonna like it? And y'all, she got a chef coming. My girl finna eat good, and them toes finna eat too. <laughs> they better, cause they look a hot mess. All right, you guys, it is officially. Oh, hold on, I need to rub y'all off, rub y'all off, rub y'all off. It's officially that time to start getting ready for the freaking party. I'm excited. Are you excited? We both got on our PJs, like we came back home and put back on our pajamas because we was just sitting and chilling yeah. until it's time to actually get ready. And now I'm over here about to start on my freaking makeup, which I am happy for. I'm excited for it, but I'm also scared. Ooh. My phone's still charging. It's that time. Yeah, it's three o'clock. I'm not being on time. I'm gonna tell you that now. Yeah. I'm, I'm, Black folks never on time. Well, dang, you didn't have to say it like that, but you right though i don't know if i if y'all remember me telling y'all but i use two different foundations y'all i use nars soft matte and then i use estate as well because i do i definitely have to mix these foundations when using these so i just do a stripe right here a stripe right here stripe right here stripe right here she's not really showing y'all she's showing me so stripe right here mm -hmm. oh i shouldn't have put none up there stripe right there uh uh, okay, that's enough. Glad I put a towel right there. Yeah, I'm glad you did too because I would have made a mess. And for Estee, I hate that they don't have a pump to actually do the makeup with, like to squeeze it out. That would be like, right, because that would be bad because what if it like falls on accident and then it all gets everywhere? Right, I think that's enough, but I'm just doing a little bit right there, right there, right there, right there. Uh, uh. Uh, Y'all during the summer, my auntie, Ethel, and my auntie Queen and I gonna teach me how to do makeup. You want us to teach you how to do makeup in the yeah, summer? During the summer. We will see. We when will we see. sit in the house. We will see. Okay, I just do these little marks until I feel like I, I'm gonna get what I like. Then I just blend out. I'm going to use this Ultimate Blending Brush by e.l.f. to blend it all the way out how I want it. Hope it don't leave no stubbles. Y'all wanna know what's crazy? What? I've been knowing about this part for the longest now, and guess what, y'all? What? Still don't know what to wear. You don't know what to wear? <laughs> no. There you go. Say. You worse than me. I usually don't put foundation on my forehead. I don't know why I did this today. I probably I'm just be it doing was a stuff. I do not be putting foundation on my forehead. So why did I do that? This thing? is cute, right? Well, this I look red. Huh? Yeah, that's cute. Now, now I look red, y'all. Try to make sure I break it down to my neck, y'all, to get it blended. I really through. like this. That's cute. I remember that shirt. You gave it to me. I know. I remember that. I never wore it, too. Y'all, one of my biggest flexes is I don't necessarily have to buy clothes. Yeah, because she get her auntie clothes. Yeah. You get your auntie clothes. What's my next step in my makeup? Do I don't the know. Oh, y'all, during the summertime, tell Ethel she should let me and DJ take over her camera for a day. What? Like, we should be, I should become, me and DJ should become YouTubers for 24 hours. So y'all want to take over? Yeah. We'll see. I'll be a better YouTuber than you. Whoa. <laughs> Whoa there. Y'all heard her. She said she's going to be a better YouTuber than her auntie. Okay, yeah. girl. That's what I want you to be. Be better than me. I know off topic is we're not supposed to wear black necessarily, but I haven't worn these yet. I think I'm going to wear these because I haven't worn these yet. Mm-hmm. So, I got my outfit of the day. And for my hair, I think I'm gonna go for that claw clamp look. Claw clamp? You like a claw clamp. You built like That's a my claw clamp. my last thing. Y'all, my outfit, it Bye. eats money. Uh -huh. I finally tried on my outfit, y'all. We picked out which one I should wear. It's good. Yep, me, her, and Cammy. Yep, it eats. Eats. Like, what they say? <laughs> yeah. Y'all, we one did a time. TikTok today. Um. We don't even know what he was saying. <laughs> we gonna be back, y'all. I'm about to finish up my makeup, and I'm gonna show y'all the end. Ah, press the red button. Mm -hmm. I just realized, y'all, I did not show y'all what I looked like before I left the house.
clothes. Just know, Mini Wee got that on, okay? I got it on. Ain't that right, niece? Mm -hmm. Yeah. I'm telling mama. I'm just playing. I'm just playing, y'all. I can't talk like that in front of her, but for real. Girl, your mom. niece, I mean, not my, your niece. Your girl, Mini Wee, got it on. I look real, real good. I got my pins in my head right now. I am literally six minutes away from the location that my party is going to be at. I am so freaking scared. Like, I am scared. I, I, don't, know, I, don't, scared. I don't know why I'm scared, but I'm scared. I'm having a little small, you know, panic attack in the inside a little bit. But I'm going to make it through, though. So I'm about to head there. I'm going to show y'all my fit and stuff before I go in. Mind y'all, I don't know what this party look like i do i don't know what it looked like no nothing they wouldn't allow me come and check it out before so i'm just i'm really excited to see how did it turn out like well, you know your sister gonna do she gonna do her thing right? she gonna do her big one of course of course of course but we go see y'all i am here at my party and i am so freaking scared i'm so scared i'm so scared i'm so scared i'm so scared y'all y'all don't understand it should be just Ooh, look at my cousin and my godson no Look at my cousin and my godson. His shoes keep falling. Hey, Look at and then it was like, it was like <laughs> hey, my baby. Oh, you ain't got makeup on. Break him here. Yeah, she get to wear press powder. Ooh, she got makeup on. <laughs> she said, you said what? What song you want to play? You caught me out here? It don't matter. If she said it don't matter. She asked me about song. Huh? You caught me out here? Yeah. Yeah, because you, you weren't supposed to even do that. We're supposed to sit down. You come in. Oh, okay. You look good, man. You look great. I, I called you for camera reasons. You, look mm -hmm. at my guy, baby, y'all. What? All right, y'all, so I'm about to get ready to go inside. I am scared. I am shaking in my freaking pants, but I'm about to go in here, see my people. Yeah, let's go. Let's, go, right. let's go, let's go, let's go. Okay, come on. I'm gonna fall in these rocks. You see it? You see it? <laughs> see the fish. Stop doing that. It's just a court record. <laughs> I am a friend of Azira. Happy birthday, Mimi. Thank you. Hi, my name is Amara. I, I am Auntie Elton Mims. You know? Oh. <laughs> I want to say that happy birthday, Elton. Thank you. And you look so pretty today. Thank you. <laughs> That's why I talk about the vibe. The vibe. <laughs> <laughs> I'm the niece Ari, and I love your outfit. What did you get from? Thank Fashion Nova. <laughs> Hello, um, we are the Johnsons. Um, we are um, Devontae's parents, and Elfu is just like a daughter to us. Um, she took a life into us way back when she was in high school. <laughs> Elton, we love you. I love and you we're too. Very proud of you. Thank you. Happy birthday. Thank Happy you. Birthday. <laughs> My name is Kia, one of Elton's cousins. Happy birthday. Thank you, Kia. You look pretty. Thank mm -hmm. you. Can we smooth out who got here? Yeah. We can. Do okay, I'm gonna get the hookah at the time. <laughs> <laughs> we can't have no hookahs in here. This is not the hookah house. <laughs> I'm just saying. I'm Shan. Hi, I'm uh, Elton's big cousin. Um, I have memories of combing these little girls' hair. Yep. <laughs> I had the pleasure of cooking for these little girls, bathing them, everything, you name it. Yep. I kept them with me and I kept them safe. I love you. Love You're you so too. Pretty. Thank Happy you. Happy birthday. Thank you. Oh, one time. Just one Come time. On, time. Y'all tell us one time, London. Yeah. All right. Come on, London. Just that? Okay. Uh, happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to Echo. <laughs> Happy birthday 
came from the heart right now. That came from the heart. Thank you, Logic. Oh my goodness. She said that came from the heart, Logic. That came from the heart, man. Two minutes. You not you giving her time, right? You know she gonna say a lot. Mm, keep the pee. Okay, okay bitch. Stand on that. I for. Uh, I'm Cammy. I'm Ethel's first cousin, favorite cousin, A1 day one. We grew up together. Um, she was something else back then, y'all. She was, she was like, I don't know, like, y'all know E, y'all know E. But anyway, we always stayed in touch. We always stayed close. We always spend the night. She spent the night over my house all the time. Oh, I, let me get to that. Hold on. She spent the night over my house too, boo boo. And then we always spent the night at Pooh House. Pooh kept us close together, taking care of us. We was everywhere. Sometimes Ilta got tired of me, ready for my ass to go home. And then she was going on her little friends. I'm like, damn, she always acting funny. All right, bitch. <laughs> and she always uh, came back around. Like, I know what. She wants some pop tarts. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. But anyway, I got Elka. She's the sweetest soul ever. She's genuine. She's dope. Um, we're going to always stay together because that's what Lady Guy wanted us to do. That's what Pooh wanted us to do. Um, we we kind of like best friends too because I only talk to her real quick. Other than that, it's just them for real. Like, Elka knows what's up with me. I ain't even got to explain. Love you. Love you too, cuz. And she's side of Godmother, by the way. <laughs> I want her to eat, though. Okay, here you go, I thought you were going to wrap or something. No, I ain't going to Thank you, cuz. Open them right now. Right now? Yes, right, right now. now. Okay. Hold Unless you want me to open it for you? Huh? You want me to open it right now? Yeah, go ahead. Okay. Record. Which way? This way? Yeah, you just. <laughs> I don't know about no camera. Okay. You suck. Okay, let's see what you got in here. And you want me to open so bad. Do the blanket first. Okay, okay. It's already here. You gotta stand up, because it's long. You gotta read it. Okay. Turn up the other way. Help her to right, hold it. Oh. The other way. Oh, she gotta read it. It's a best cousin ever. Follow your dream, follow your heart. I will always love you. I cherish the times that we are together and miss you when we are. Hold on. When we, when we are apart, even when I am not close by. I want you to know I love you. Thank you for standing by my side when times get hard. Thank you for making me laugh when I don't even want to smile. I'm so blessed to have you as a cut. I'm so blessed to have a cousin like you. Wrap yourself up in this blanket and consider it a big hug. Thank you so much, girl. Show that to you. Show that to you. That's so sweet. You like them? Oh, my goodness. Oh, oh thank you so sweet for that. Oh, that's nice. Thank you, cuz. Okay. What is that? I think I think I know what it is. I think I know what it is. I think I know what this is. You know I love my flowers. <laughs> oh, it's cute. Look, she gave me a little bit of flower. Okay. Flower that did not. Thank you. Okay, hold on. Wait. How you turn this back on? Whoa. You know oh, me. Who the hell's Ethel? You know me. She knows me. That's a version? Right. I love a good wine. She knows oh. that. She, she knows me. So you know me. You know me. You know me. I like it. Hold on, man. I know you drink wine. Last thing I'm going to open y'all, then we go continue. Hold on. You ice me out, bro. Mm -mm, man. I ain't got money like Eli. She going to chill out. <laughs> it says, especially for you, may every joy. May, what? Don't tell me May every joy of the days be yours. Be yourself and keep giving. She bought me a bracelet, y'all, and it say best cousin ever in it. You got it engraved. Oh, okay, that's what's up. You took time out. Y'all give her a round of applause. Yeah, that's weird. That's Get her hug. Picture perfect. This is my brother, y'all. Tell, tell him who you are and say what you got to say to Elba. Oh, what happened, everybody? How y'all doing in here? Hey, Steph. I need a little bit more energy. What's up, though? How y'all doing? Huh? All uh, right, my name is Stuff on Doom. You know what I'm saying? What's it? Uh-oh, I'm going to go. What's up, dog? Hey! Give me a hug, bro. I see you so long. What's up, what's happening, Louis? Uh, I just want to say happy birthday to you. Thank you. Take me outside later on. I got you. For I sure, got you. Sure. I got you.
She looks so cute, y'all. She's beautiful. Yeah. Stand on that. <laughs> I want to say happy birthday to you. Go away, go away. Go away. Happy birthday to you. To you. I want to say close your eyes and make a wish. Y'all can eat all my cake now. Close your eyes and make a wish. And think about it. And blow out the candles. I wish I won't come back. No, yeah. hold on, chill out, chill out, chill out, chill out. Chill out. I definitely wish that. She, right. she, she, she here? here? She here? Hold on, hold on. Go cut that she said, cut her hey, piece of cake. She want to show her how to play. Happy. Oh, oh, we already said happy. Why, why are you here? Oh, look, ain't no place. Oh. Your mini wheat has had a long week. In. Mini wheat is stressed. Mini wheat is exhausted. Mini wheat, I'm not stressed. I'm sorry, I used the wrong word. Mini wheat is exhausted. Mini wheat is tired. And yet, I am still up trying to function. <laughs> I have a lot to freaking talk to you guys about. Like, a lot just about my whole entire weekend. We have to open up presents. Oh, my gosh. It's a lot that I have to, you know, come and, you know, give y'all update on and talk about. Because I haven't I haven't updated y'all since the party at all. I don't, I don't even think I got back on the camera after the party at all. I had a lot going on. But just know your girl, Minnie, we had a great time. I'm up right now. It's like 1030. I got on my clothes. I got dressed and stuff. I'm about to head to my lash appointment because I have a freaking fill-in appointment on today. So I need to head there because that appointment is at 1130. Yeah, that appointment is at 1130 and I need to be there on time because it takes me like at least 30 minutes to get over there to that side of town. So that's where we're headed. Once I get done, once I get done after my lashes, I'm going to come back home and we are going to chat. I have to tell y'all everything about this weekend because this weekend was fun. This weekend was mind-blowing shocking just everything oh my god i just gotta tell y'all because it was just i don't know i just really 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 had a great time and i'm ready to tell y'all give y'all update on everything and open the gifts and stuff with y'all so i'll be back later just hold off on me for one little bit <laughs> i'm back i'm back i'm back i'm back and the lashes are all freaking done i am about to grab me something to eat y'all i drove all the way here to jj's because y'all don't know jj's is really 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 good here in atlanta and i found one that has a drive through because y'all I do not like walking inside of food places sometimes by myself but I found one that has the drive through and I'm ready to eat I'm ready to grab me something to eat. all I just just could you know taste right now is just that white little stuff on top of the chicken like this that's like the best thing ever whoever invented that or came up with putting that on top of that on top of the chicken like that y'all did y'all big one because that freaking stuff is really really good it's like I don't know what it is but it's just real good here is your girl mini we after returning home and taking a nap took a nap i took a nap y'all i need some sleep because this weekend was a lot <laughs> i've been moving 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 i need some sleep i need some proper sleep at that but let's go ahead and get into this weekend because i feel like the last of course the last time y'all saw me was at my freaking party i believe in the midst of me getting dressed i don't even think i even showed y'all the outfit before even leaving to head out to my party because why my party started at 4 30 i arrived at least by 6 p.m but I guess it worked out because I heard that everybody didn't even get there until a little bit later anyways. And even when I got there, I still had to wait in my car before they even decided to let me in. But anyways, let's just get right into it. When I tell my freaking party was so freaking beautiful shout out to my sister y'all if y'all want to party decorated or whatever if you are in montgomery alabama at that and you looking for looking for a decorator for like baby showers weddings parties just like how i had anything dealing with decorations or whatever and y'all like the theme of my stuff y'all need to check out my sister and her husband y'all her business is called azira's touch she's located in Mon 
not Montgomery. She's located in Mirabrook, Alabama, but it's kind of like the same because that area is like the same. And I know sometimes she do travel to do um, decor. So hey, shout outs to my sister, y'all. Because when I tell y'all she did her thing, she executed exactly what I wanted for the party, y'all. Like I can't even believe that she really executed it and she really like made it happen. Even though I knew she was gonna do it, but like her and her husband made it happen, y'all. And I shout outs to them because that's the first thing I need to say when I'm hopping on here. Shout outs to them because if it wasn't for them, I wouldn't even have a party, y'all. She insisted on me having a party. She was like, no, this is your very first party. You need to, you know, do something. You know, this is your birthday. Over the past few years, you really don't be doing too much on your birthday. This year, you're doing something. You're back near the family. Let's go ahead and, you know, have a party. You know, let's celebrate mini week, okay? Your girl about to be big 23, March 12th, which is tomorrow. Today is March 11th. But so first thing I want to say is shout out to my sister. Thank you so much for that. I love you. I love you. I love you. I love you. I love you for that. I love you in general. You already know that. I, I could go on and on about my sister, y'all. But yes, the party was freaking beautiful. The food, oh my gosh, was so freaking good. Yo, while I'm in the midst of the party, I'm too busy walking around doing other stuff, y'all. I barely eating like my food, but the food, like when I did eat it, the food was amazing. Shout out to that chef, y'all. Whoever that chef was, sis, you need to tell me because he did his thing with that food. That food was so freaking good. Them ribs was so good. Oh my gosh, the whole tray of ribs was gone. The devil eggs was gone. Everything was gone. I just wanted more, wanted more, wanted more, but that food was delicious. She she booked the chef for me. She booked the DJ to come, you know, play the music and stuff. And that building that I, would in, I was in, that was actually her second building. She had one building already, and that was her second location where she had my party at. But I'm so thankful for her, y'all. I just keep saying it because I just, I can't believe that I even celebrated my birthday this year. Like, I, who would have expected for me to have a freaking party i did not know that i was gonna do that like i didn't know that she was I, did, I just didn't know that i was gonna do that so i don't know i had fun though when i say i had fun i had fun now in the midst of me walking in i was already a little shy because like like my family they my family and all but they haven't really seen me out my shell the only person who really see me out my shell is like my cousins and stuff like they know how we at because we all around the same age but i was a little shy for a minute but after i after i was in there for a while i just you know loosened up or whatever because hey it's my family in here they already know how i act you know well they don't know how i act on the turn up side e but i definitely got turned up at the party y'all they played the good music my cousin Cam, she turned me up then all of my friends was there shout out to all of my friends that did come y'all shout out to y'all my best friend y'all she came tell me why she freaking tricked me like she was not coming like she told me that she had regionals this weekend that she's not gonna be able to make it and i was like okay that's cool fine you know you could just come with me on my actual birthday which is during the week march 12th because she was gonna be able to do that my party was on march 9th and y'all she tricked me like she was going to her regionals bro like i was under the, i was under the impression that she was not going to show up like i was told that she had something to do she told me that and i had had no idea that she was going to pop up so when she popped up at my party y'all i was like oh my god like i gasped so hard <laughs> y'all should have seen me in the chair y'all my eyes got booked because i was like what the crap my best friend just walked in here like i was like you lied to me i'm gonna get you i'm gonna get you i'm gonna get you but that really did make my day y'all when she walked in on me y'all that really made me so happy because i really thought she wasn't gonna be there the fact it's the crazy thing because her and cam is the ones who put it together that is so funny like that was so crazy like cam definitely kept that secret that's that was crazy so cam and area i'm around round of applause for that because y'all definitely kept that a secret and i'm surprised i did not catch it from cam like that's crazy what else happened before i even get into these gifts i'm just happy that everybody showed up like everybody participated everybody color coordinated everybody wore the brown and stuff like we all looked good we all looked good we all looked good i enjoyed my time with my nieces my nephews like we was having dance battles and everything up in there y'all and then we was listening to cam song because cam got a new rap song and she was of course rapping her old song and then my sister husband been make music as well and he have a song called rider y'all and we was playing that and we was jamming to that it was so much fun though it was so much fun everybody had fun okay now let's get into my freaking gifts mm -hmm. oh my gifts 
All right, some of these are already open, y'all, because I opened at the party, but I just want to show y'all. I have a card from my uncle. Let's start with the card. Say, for a wonderful niece, hope your birthday is filled with love and warmth and blessings. He said, thanks for all that you do. Uncle Cookie, love you, love you always and forever. Happy birthday. I love my uncle, y'all. The crazy thing is the, my Mini Wheat name come from my uncle. He always called me Mini Wheat as a baby, and that just stuck with me. Everybody called me Mini Wheat. I love my uncle. He did have some money in here, y'all. already took the money out. I already took the money out, but shout out to my uncle. Thank you so much. I love you to death that you already know that. He's my favorite uncle, y'all. He already know that. Then we have to my sweet girl, no, to my sweet cousin Ethel from Shan and the, no, Sean. My bad, from Sean and the family. Wait, I think it say Sean. Okay, I'm sorry. Because I'm trying to read cursive. But in this card, let's see. I didn't open this one. It said a prayer. This is the card, what it says in the front. It said a prayer for you on your birthday. I said a special prayer for all that makes you happiest for quiet moments when your day are busy. When your days are busy in time. In time for the big and little things that mean the most to you. And it say love. Sean and the family. For love and joy to feel each day and warm warm memories to look back on. For smiles and happiness and the closeness of family and friends. Happy birthday. And I got me a freaking Sephora <coughs> gift card. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you, family. I got me a Sephora gift card. I know you be paying attention. I'm about to go use this tomorrow. Yeah, I'm about to use this tomorrow. This one. Oh, this from my cousin Cam. Let's read, let's read, let's read. Today belongs to you. Happy birthday, cousin. We have been locked in since we found out we were first cousins. I want you to know that I got you forever and I love you forever and always. Keep being your unique self and stay sweet, my Pisces twin. Cousin Cam, y'all. Y'all already know her. I love her to death. That's my first cousin, y'all. I love Cam. So I love you too. If you're watching this video, love you. And my baby, Messiah. And Quiz. <laughs> I don't know who this card came from. It don't have a name on it. Hopefully it got something in the inside though. A name in the inside. God brings us special people who are thoughtful, warm, and caring, and who put love in everything they do. Love you, and God bless you, smile. I can't read the name, y'all. I can't read this cursive. I can't read the name, but thank you so much. I wanna say this from Miss Yolanda, I believe. Wait, what this name say? This not say Yolanda. This say something else. I cannot read the cursive name, y'all. I can't read the name, but shout outs to you for giving me this card. Thank you so much, and I love you so, so much as well. I love all of my family. Now in this bag, this is from Pam, Quest, and Messiah. So we gonna start off with this. My cousin got me a blanket with her own little text on it. Like she put her own like words that she wanted to use on this blanket. And here it is, say best cousin ever. And it says a little message over here on the other side of it. Y'all probably can't see the whole thing, but she put like a sweet message on here, y'all. And I was so happy that she did this. The fact that she even got this for me, thank you so much. I'm definitely gonna be using this blanket especially when I'm traveling. But she got me this, y'all, and I was reading it out loud. She almost made me cry for real. What what it says, like the message on here that it says. But I really appreciate it. This was so freaking cute and thoughtful. Also got me a freaking flower thingy, y'all. Oh, this is really cute. I actually know what I'm gonna do with this. So I have this flower thing that's blue and it actually lights up, y'all. How do I do it? It lights up like this. This is so freaking cool. Like, this is so cute. So cool, y'all. I love this. I don't know if y'all can see for real. It's real cool, though. It's blue with all these different color lights. So I'm definitely putting this inside of my room. I got me some freaking wine. Oh, peach bellini, okay. My cousin know I love some peach. I love a lot of things that's peach, but um, this is a wine. Peach bellini. Okay, okay, okay. I can't wait to drink this. Real cute. Put it over there with my collection already. <laughs> I also got this, y'all. She got me a bracelet that's engraved i opened this one already but it's engraved inside best cousin ever this is the bracelet y'all it has a cute little heart on it i don't know if y'all can see but it has a cute little heart on it as you can see right here and then on the I don't know if y'all can see, but the inside, on the inside of it say best cousin ever. My little wrist is so freaking little, so it be hanging off. Like, look, y'all. My wrist is so little, so it don't, like, actually fit. But I feel like if I bend it, yeah, I, oh, it's bendable, okay. I can bend it and squeeze it all the way in to fit my wrist. Yeah, it definitely bends. Okay, so shout-outs to my cousin for this. Thank her so, so much. What else in here? Okay, she bought me a little planner book. It come with a little pen, and it say believe. I definitely need this. I definitely needed this, cuz. <laughs> I 
I definitely needed this. Oh, she bought me little claw clips because she know I love claw clips. She know I love me some claw clips. Okay, a hand sanitizer. I think that's it. I think that's it. I think that's it. I think that's it. Yeah, okay. That's everything out of that bag. So, shout outs to everybody who was at my party, y'all. Thank you for just coming. I did get more, more money and stuff when I was at the party. So, I love each and every one of you. And thank you all for the freaking gifts. Thank y'all. Thank you to everybody who gave me something. Thank, thank you to everybody who just showed up in general. I just keep saying it. But that's because I'm just so happy. Like, I really enjoy my weekend. Let me tell y'all, I drunk or something a little bit. I had me some douce. And when I tell y'all, uh-uh, never again. Oh, not never again. I can't say that. Never say never. But I'm not, I, look, douce, the way how it had me feeling the very next day going home, I don't think I want to feel like that again. Like, let me just tell y'all the rundown. I drunk this douce the night of my party. Like, right after my party, because me and my cousin went riding around or whatever. And we, you know, hung out a little bit. Drunk us some douce. And I'm telling y'all, that drink, like, it, it didn't... I was feeling good, right? You know how you drink a drink, but you feel yourself getting like, you get yourself feeling right, right? But I didn't, I don't know, I say woozy. I use the word woozy, like, the word woozy for me means feeling good, like, you know, you, you feel good, like, the tequila warm you up. Usually when I take, like, Casamigos or something, I get, like, woozy, like, after one or two shots. That do say, I had a shot, I only had one shot or two shots, I believe. I believe I only had two. And it didn't get me woozy at all that night. That night, I was woozy. I was, you know, good. I was good, I was good, I was good. But the next day, why well, I felt like I had a hungover? Like, what? I was like, did the drink catch up to me over time? Like, overnight? Because I was not feeling like this when I was actually taking those two shots. I did not feel like that. I was good. Like, I wasn't woozy. I, wasn't, I was just good. I was just regular. But the next day, I felt like I had a hungover. Over. Like I took a million of shots. Like I took like 20, 30 shots, which I did. Oh, I hope nobody is taking 20, 30 shots. Okay. But I was like, I was so confused when I woke up the next day, y'all. Cause I'm like, why do I feel like I have a, a hangover? Why do I feel, why do I feel drunk now? Okay. <laughs> like I was like, what in the world? I didn't like really like that effect like that. But I was operating, driving home on Sunday off of one hour of sleep. That right there was in saying because i've been fighting for some sleep well i've been fighting my dear sleep since i've got back here hopefully tonight i can get the proper sleep that i need but unfortunately i don't think i am because i still have more work that i gotta complete y'all when i came home on sunday i dropped my niece and nephew off back to their mom and i came home still had to complete some work while only operating off an hour of sleep literally and the only reason why i had only had an hour of sleep is because i was out all freaking night with my cousin literally out all night like i'm still not getting no sleep even today i thought okay maybe you know last night when i completed the work that i need to complete that was due today i was go lay down and get some sleep i wake up that was yesterday that was last night i wake up today come to find out i have a freaking lash appointment this morning that i have to wake up early for and i was like oh my god I still can't get no proper sleep. Let, le go to my lash appointment, get my lashes done, come back home. Still had to complete some work. Now I did end up falling asleep on my laptop. That's why I say I got home and I took me a nap. But as I was literally on my laptop and I fell asleep while on my laptop, y'all. While I completed some freaking work. And I ended up waking up like a, I don't know, probably like, I probably got like two. I probably at least got like two or three hours worth of sleep then. And uh, I had to hurry up and get myself back up because I forgot that I didn't submit what I needed to submit. But I ended up submitting it out so i'm good right now but oh my god child i need some sleep i need some good sleep and hopefully i can get that tonight right now it's 805 yeah 805 p.m i'm about to clean up because my house is a mess i didn't even unpack my luggage is still sitting over here i just want i need some sleep tomorrow i still have to get up early because i have content to create that i have to submit and turn in as well so pray for me look like i probably don't get no sleep to this weekend then tomorrow is my birthday i just want to sleep but i can't I mean, I, tomorrow it's gonna be a full-blown work day because i I just have to get my work completed, so. It is what it is. I hope you guys enjoyed. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Before I even end the video off, hold on. Okay, before I close out the vlog, I wanted to show y'all this painting that the creator lady made for me, y'all. My sister book 
like this activity for us to do with painting everybody had to paint like their own like picture of me of course i was already drawn out all they had to do was just fill fill me in with colors and stuff this was the actual one made by the lady who actually hosted this part of the party dang i'm gonna have her stuff attached on the video because she did she was speaking i know i recorded her speaking at my party like you know giving her socials out and basically telling us what she do but she paints and she did so amazing like look at this this is so freaking beautiful y'all like i have a bunch of these like everybody created one and everybody gave them to me and of course i'm gonna hang them all up on my wall because this is a memory for me it's gonna always be a memory for me so i'm definitely putting this up in my house i have like 30 paintings to hang up but i'm gonna like put them all together like I'm gonna shape it out a certain way and put it put them all up on my wall. Y'all will see that in another vlog though when I actually hang those up. But this one right here is, is actually gonna sit on my dresser because she also made me a stand for it that says mini week. So this just go on here like that, which is really, really cute. And I really enjoy it and love it. So shout outs to you for doing this. This was actually really, really fun. A really fun activity that everybody did, that everybody participated in too. Because I would I didn't even think anybody was gonna participate in painting <laughs> like real deal painting and everybody did so i am super happy for that but this was a really cool idea now your girl mini we is about to end this vlog off i feel like i gave y'all a recap on majority everything that i needed and y'all stay tuned for the very next video i'm about to try to clean up wrap things up get my stuff prepared and together for tomorrow and i will see you guys in their very <laughs> i will see you guys in the very next vlog peace out Love you all and happy birthday to me. And if it's your birthday, happy birthday to you. Now I'm out now. Peace out. See y'all in the next video. <laughs>